أكد صاحب السمو الملكي الأمير سلمان بن حمد الخليفة ولي العهد رئيس مجلس الوزراء مواصلة العمل على توثيق أواصر التعاون والتنسيق المشترك بين مملكة البحرين والولايات المتحدة الأمريكية الصديقة مشيرا سموه إلى أهمية الدفع بالعلاقات البحرينية الأمريكية نحو مستويات أكثر تقدما ومواصلة تعزيز المسارات الثنائية بين مملكة البحرين والولايات المتحدة الممتدة لأكثر من 75 عاما والتي تم خلال ببناء شراكة استراتيجية عززت الأمن في المنطقة وساهمت في الحفاظ على أسس السلام والاستقرار والازدهار في العالم لافتا إلى أهمية مواصلة السعي من قبل الجميع لإيجاد الطرق السلمية والدبلوماسية لحل مختلف القضايا جاء ذلك لدى لقاء سمو حفظه الله اليوم مع السيد أنتوني بلينكن وزير خارجية الولايات المتحدة الأمريكية وذلك في إطار زيارة رسمية التي يقوم بها سموه إلى الولايات المتحدة الأمريكية well, Reference to Washington, uh, but I really should say back to Washington. Uh, I think you probably spent as much time here, including as a student at American University, as uh, as any of us have. So this is a, this is almost a second home, and uh, so we're so pleased to uh, to welcome you here to welcome you back. Uh, it is uh, evidence of when we were just talking about this uh, an extraordinary, long-standing uh, partnership between Bahrain and the United States, going back 75 years. 75 years. Uh, through thick and thin, and uh, we deeply appreciate it, we deeply value it, uh, and uh, it's uh, important not only to remind ourselves of that, but of course to focus on the work that we have before us uh, going forward. I want to uh, say at the outset uh, how much we appreciate uh, Bahrain's strong support for the resolution, the historic resolution voted today uh, at the United Nations uh, General Assembly uh, condemning the Russian aggression against Ukraine and supporting Ukraine uh, in its uh, efforts to preserve its sovereignty, its territorial integrity, uh, its independence. Uh, this was a uh, remarkable moment, 141 countries coming together uh, loudly, clearly uh, on this matter. We're grateful for, uh, for Bahrain's uh, support. Uh, Bahrain, of course, is a uh, major non-NATO ally, uh, a close partner uh, on uh, security, but also on, on many other issues. I uh, applaud as well. Through the Abraham Accords uh, to uh, uh, free, uh, relations uh, between uh, Bahrain and Israel, and of course other countries in Israel, to a place where the benefits to the people of both countries are, are strongly developed. And I uh, applaud your leadership uh, on that as well. So we have uh, a lot to talk about. There's a lot going on in the world, a lot going on uh, in the region. Uh, and it's really good to have you here to be able to pursue our conversations. Welcome. Mr. Secretary, um, ladies and gentlemen, it's a, a real pleasure to be here. Thank you for welcoming me. Uh, it is a uh, homecoming of sorts always when I come to Washington. It's a city I know well. It is a city that has had great impact on uh, myself, the people of Bahrain, and my country. Uh, over the 75 years, we have built a security partnership that has guaranteed security and stability, not just of the region, but of the world. And we have played a key role, uh, small though we are, in ensuring that uh, the United States and uh, the responsible governments of the world preserve an international rules-based order. This is key. Uh, we have decades now of general global peace, uh, and that is largely due to that international rules of order. Its current state of affairs is deeply concerning, and I think we must do everything in our power to urge everyone to de-escalate and uh, to return to the more normative ways of solving issues. Um, in any case, uh, I'm very happy that we can come here on the back uh, of that 75 year history mm -hmm. and on to bigger and better things. And I look forward to discussing ways that we can enhance our strategic security relationship and our strategic economic relationship. Also, by becoming
becoming ever more close in our work together, I think there is inevitably uh, an exchange of values and, and, and shared vision. And that can't be bad for me. So thank you for welcoming us. Thank you for taking such good care of us.